a new and highly exciting research with great anticipation and significant interest from scientists worldwide. This research has uncovered an extremely simple method that requires neither diet nor exercise, which effectively reduces post-meal blood sugar levels by as much as 52%, and insulin secretion is reduced by approximately 60%. Welcome everyone, hello and welcome to Nutriology Harvest. We're thrilled to have you join us on this journey of exploration and discovery. In today's video, we'll be delving into a groundbreaking research study that sheds new light on metabolic regulation and its impact on blood sugar levels. So let's jump right into the details of this revolutionary experiment. This discovery led to a remarkable improvement in the metabolic processing of blood glucose and blood lipids, generally known as fats. So what's the background? Let's provide a quick overview so that we can comprehend the essence of this research. In our body, there is a muscle known as the soleus muscle, present in both sides of the calf. It's a small muscle that accounts for only about 1% of the body's mass. This soleus muscle behaves differently in terms of its energy consumption compared to other muscles. It predominantly draws its energy directly from the bloodstream rather than relying on stored glycogen. This means that it mainly relies on glucose from the blood for energy during contraction and relaxation, requiring only a minimal amount of glycogen. The researchers found that by causing this muscle to contract and relax for extended periods without causing fatigue, it could efficiently draw glucose from the blood, resulting in decreased blood glucose levels. This, in turn, reduces the need for a significant insulin response after a meal. The researchers at the University of Houston developed a simple and ingenious method to target this muscle's contraction and relaxation through a subtle movement, resulting in the efficient withdrawal of glucose from the blood. The researchers began by investigating the soleus muscle, a deep calf muscle that is primarily responsible for maintaining posture and stability during standing and walking. They hypothesized that this muscle's unique properties could play a crucial role in regulating blood sugar levels and overall metabolism. To test their hypothesis, the researchers conducted a series of experiments involving participants with different characteristics, such as age, body composition, and activity levels. The goal was to understand how the soleus muscle's activity could impact blood sugar levels and insulin secretion. Experiment Setup 1. Participant Selection A diverse group of participants was selected to represent a range of metabolic profiles. This included individuals with varying levels of physical activity, body mass index, BMI, and age. 2. Controlled Meals Participants were provided with standardized meals to ensure consistency in nutrient intake. These meals were designed to be representative of typical daily diets and contained a mix of carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. 3. Blood glucose monitoring. Continuous glucose monitoring was used to track participants' blood sugar levels throughout the experiment. This involved placing sensors on the participants' skin to measure glucose levels in real time. 4. Simple leg movement. The experimental intervention involved a simple leg movement performed by the participants. While seated, participants were instructed to lift and lower one leg repeatedly. This movement primarily engaged the soleus muscle. Experimental procedure. 1. Baseline measurements. Before the experiment, participants underwent baseline measurements, including blood sugar levels, insulin sensitivity, and metabolic parameters. 2. Post-meal movement. After consuming the standardized meal, participants immediately performed the simple leg movement for a specified duration, such as 15 to 30 minutes. 3. Blood sugar response. Researchers monitored participants' blood sugar levels before and after the leg movement. They observed how blood sugar levels changed in response to the movement. 4. Insulin secretion analysis. Insulin secretion levels were also tracked using blood samples. This allowed researchers to determine how the simple leg movement affected insulin release in response to the meal. Key Findings 1. Blood Sugar Reduction The simple leg movement was found to lead to a significant reduction in post-meal blood sugar levels. This reduction was consistently observed across participants of different profiles. 2. Insulin Secretion Decrease after performing the leg movement, 
participants exhibited a substantial decrease in insulin secretion. This decrease was particularly prominent in relation to the amount of glucose present in the bloodstream. 3. Implications for Metabolism The findings suggested that the activity of the soleus muscle has a direct impact on glucose utilization and insulin secretion. The muscle's contractions effectively drew glucose from the bloodstream, contributing to lower blood sugar levels and reduced insulin demand. Conclusion The research provides compelling evidence that the soleus muscle, through its unique energy utilization, can play a significant role in metabolic regulation. The simple leg movement proved to be an effective way to reduce post-meal blood sugar levels and insulin secretion, suggesting a potential avenue for managing metabolic conditions such as diabetes. These findings open up new possibilities for non-pharmacological interventions to regulate blood sugar and improve metabolic health. Incorporating the simple leg movement into daily routines after meals could offer a practical and sustainable approach to support metabolic regulation. It's important to note that while this research provides exciting insights, further studies are needed to validate and explore the long-term implications of this approach. Nonetheless, this discovery has the potential to revolutionize how we think about managing blood sugar levels and overall metabolic health. If you enjoyed the video and discovered valuable insights, kindly show your support by giving it a thumbs up and considering subscribing to my channel. For further details and additional resources, do check out the references listed below the video. Stay informed and thrilled with our upcoming content. Make sure to stay tuned for more exciting updates.